Top 10 Signs of a Low Value Employee Welcome to our channel, The Enchanted Luxury Studio, where we talk about wealth and luxury. The behavior of employees in the workplace is detrimental to the success of the organization. For this reason, it is imperative to observe workforce culture and practices inside the company. It is possible to predict longer outcomes by studying habitual manners, practices, and performances of the employees. Determining if the organization has a majority of low-value employees might help eliminate possible downfall by either addressing the root cause of the problem or completely removing the workforce liabilities. So here are the signs of a low-value employee. Starting at number 1, the lack of excellent performance. The main metric to determine the value of employees is the tangible results of their performances. Poor turnouts are an indication of their lack of knowledge and expertise about their jobs. Aside from the result, the frequency of their useful contribution to the improvement of the organization. Low-value employees will have a smaller, if not completely, lacking amount of achievements. They simply fail to put in the extra effort to better accomplish the task or they are not fit for the job requirement. These employees will be easy to spot because of paper trails and factual records available to evaluate the result of their performances. Number 2. Lack of Dedication and Passion Aside from the result, it is also important to take notice of the behavior and the regular action of the employees during work hours. Low-value employees have an apathetic attitude toward their tasks. Their work ethics are dangerously lacking and underdeveloped. Multiple aspects of their attitude and work practices should be observed and considered to determine and address the problem. The first sign is their lack of enthusiasm and vigor when accomplishing company duties. Low-value employees are often complacent and advocate mediocrity. They lack the passion to do better and improve. The second sign is their sluggish participation in company activities and achievement of goals. They often exploit their co-workers to take on more responsibility so they don't have to do so. Another sign of this is the frequent unwarranted absences. The absence of passion can be observed in the attendance record. If an employee accepts and gives importance to his job, he will show enthusiasm and will be productively present when he is needed in the workplace. The last sign that belongs to this category of low-value employees is the absence of punctuality. Chronic lateness is a disease with detrimental effects on the improvement of the company. If an employee is always late, he will accomplish and contribute less. When these attitudes and practices prevail, an employee will no longer be an asset to the business. Number 3. Unearned Overconfidence One of the worst qualities of someone is overconfidence without legitimate merit. When confidence is merely based on feeling instead of results, it will birth mediocrity and recklessness. If not properly addressed, this quality of a low-value employee will result in multiple workplace error and conflicts. The mindset of being better than others will prohibit an employee to evaluate his shortcomings which will result in the inability to do better. Unearned overconfidence is harmful to both the employees and the business. Number 4. Lack of willingness to learn and improve Most of the time, employees need to venture into different approaches and ideas to improve their abilities. They need to invest more time and effort to conduct additional research about the tasks assigned to them. However, low-value employees will be unwilling to take this path because they either content with their abilities or they are simply too lazy to take the extra mile to improve. Sometimes, curiosity opens to boxes of new ideas that will be an asset for the business organization. Low-value employees who lack the thirst for improvement will miss out and will remain stuck. Employees like this will lose desirability to their employers because this negative quality will make them a liability to the company instead of an asset. 
Number 5. Absence of Commitment Companies are often invested in hiring potential employees who will be committed to growing them. Low-value employees lack the required commitment to thrive in the workforce environment. They fail to gain new methods to address problems and they lack the capacity to develop new strategies because they are not as committed as they should be. This shortcoming will eventually lead them to the tedious and frozen boot of inferiority. They are less valued by the company because the results they contribute are of the minimum qualifications. Excellence can only be achieved if the effort is at the maximum capacity. However, low-value employees are not committed enough to achieve it. Go ahead and get your favorite beverage and popcorn. Subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications. Number 6. Lack of Beneficial Communication Skills Excellent communication skills are beneficial to every industry because it is the vessel of information and knowledge. The accurate flow of data is crucial in an organization because success and failure are dependent on it. Pieces of information should flow smoothly between the management and other employees. So an employee is valued lower if he is incapable of communicating effectively. Employees need to deliver and discuss their ideas to achieve the excellent results that their organization requires. Bad communication skills will jeopardize the desired result. Also, the failure to communicate effectively between employees can cause misunderstandings and unnecessary disputes. Low-value employees who lack communication skills are either voiceless inside the organization or liabilities of the company. Number 7. Lack of Accountability Criticism and feedback are necessary parts of improvement in every industry. However, low-value employees will fail to look through them to be better because they lack accountability. They will find ways to blame it on other employees and other factors instead of taking responsibility. They either have a hard time seeing their mistakes or they just don't care enough to improve. Low-value employees will often avoid taking control of the situation because they don't want the responsibility it requires. Number 8. Insubordination to authority and policies Rules and regulation inside any system are meant to maintain order and avoid chaos. They are necessary standards to keep everything in check. So the blatant disregard for rules and regulation inside the workplace is harmful to both the organization and its employees. Low-value employees are often times the culprit of violations that lead to disruption of the peaceful work environment. The authority has a required function inside the organization, so it is important to adhere to their policies. Low-value employees mistakenly think that they are above these policies. In the long run, too much insubordination and rule-breaking will cause the company detrimental consequences. Number 9. Prone to Conflict and Dispute Grievances and disputes cause unnecessary toxicity in the workplace. Low-value employees may oftentimes steer conflicts that contribute to negativity and the overall vibe in the workplace. They are prone to drain out their co-workers' energies because they participate in over-the-top disputes. Unfortunately, they drug others because they lack the ability to address their concerns professionally. For this reason, this type of low-value employees fail to establish valuable relationships with their colleagues. They are often times avoided by others. As a result, their participation and productive contribution to the company are limited. Number 10. Inability to Adopt Low-value employees have a hard time adopting to constant changes and improvements. Their lack of flexibility hinders them from achieving the maximum capacity of their outputs. They fail to reach excellence because of their incapability to embrace improvements. Instead of viewing changes as an opportunity to improve, they choose to see them as hindrances and treat them as problems instead. For this reason, they are unmotivated and irksome. This negative view leads them to failure. 
There you have it, the top 10 signs of low-value employee. Thank you for spending some time with us today. We hope that our list will help you. Let us know your thoughts in the comments. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.